Today I'll be showing you how to make a very cool parallax effect in Scratch. And it's super easy, it only takes one sprite. So this sprite is called Layers. And if we go into Costumes, we can see all the layers. And by the way, this art was made by Walio, so go follow him. So the very front layer is the last costume, and the very back layer is the first costume. Now, go to Code, one green flag click to start the program, and then make a block. Let's call it Render. And we'll run without screen fresh. Alright, here we have it. And let's put this under one green flag clicked. So the reason for this is because we want the clone to show up immediately. Alright, now we'll switch our costume to 11. So the very front layer. And go to x0, y0. So the center of the screen. Then we'll make a new variable. Call it clone ID. And this should be for this sprite only. Which also means for this clone only. So we're gonna set clone ID to 1 for now. And then height. Okay, after this I'm going to repeat. 11 times because that's the number of layers I have but if you have for example 15 layers then you'll have to repeat 15 times okay so we're gonna be creating a clone of myself and switch costume to the previous costume but we don't have that block so we'll have to just do switch costume to costume number minus one okay now we just need to change clone ID by one and while we're here, let's just hide our clone ID. Okay, and now we're done with our custom block. Now we move on to the clone code. When I start as a clone, we're going to go to the back layer because we start with 11. So every time it's going to go to the back layer. Then we're going to show and set our clone ID to clone ID. And this makes it so we actually have this ID of whatever was in here. Then it's simple. A forever loop and a go to x0, y0. And all we have to do do is change this so get out divided by and then times and duplicate it I'm gonna do clone ID times 5 this is just to make it bigger then we'll get out mouse X and mouse Y now let's put them in there and full screen and there you have it guys a working parallax effect I really hope you enjoyed that video if you want to see more effects then this video is perfect for you